I'm okay. I I'm just really upset. I'm mad at her. It's weird because I'd never gotten mad at her before. I feel like our friendship's over. She deserves for me to be mad at her for what she did. She ate my last chicken roll. I was so hungry. I asked her to set the microwave timer for 10 minutes and she said for a minute. Do you understand that? We saw our old teacher from third grade and she wouldn't say hi to her. I let her borrow my favorite giant shirt and she cut a hole in the armpit. She borrowed my tea kettle. When she returned it, there was a cucumber stuck in it. Like, that's not okay. I'm so mad at her. I told her to close the gate in my backyard and I let my dog out and she never closed the gate and the dog, I got, I lost the dog. We were at the zoo in the reptile section. I just asked for a picture of myself in front of the iguana and she wouldn't take one of me. We ran into Chris Rock in the parking lot. I smiled at him and she just turned the other way. I'm so mad at her. She came over and ate my last piece of eggplant rollatini. She ate my last piece of sushi. She ate my last tiger shrimp. She ate the last piece of devil's food cake that was frozen in the freezer. She ate my last coconut rum pie. She ate my last pecan dish. I had a piece of bacon in the freezer. She came over and just ate it right in front of me. I was shopping at Dwayne Reed, picking up some mints, and she saw me and she looked the other way. What kind of friend does that? I was in line at Dwayne Reed and I saw her two people ahead of me. She picked a piece of Orbit gum out of its wrapper and threw it at my head. She took a stiletto and she threw it at me. I asked her to TiVo Wheel of Fortune and she she didn't do it. There was no TiVo recorded at all. I asked her to call my dermatologist to reschedule my appointment and she said to do it myself. I'm so mad at her. We had just landed in JFK airport and I had to use the ladies room. She said, we don't have time for this. I have to get home and watch Jeopardy. I'm so mad at her. I left work early to meet her outside Red Lobster and I waited 45 minutes for her to show up and she said she had already eaten. We went to the movies to see the movie Brave. We had a fight over whose armrest it was. I texted her that I saw a shooting star and she responded with, who cares? I'm just really upset. It's just, you become friends with someone for so long and I can't, it's over. I just don't trust her. Listen, I have to go. Sharice fixed his car and we're going out joyriding. Call me later if you're still thinking about it. Bye.